Hello there, welcome back! So for me, it's been like two weeks since the last video, and uh, videos are out now, and I just want to thank everyone for being so lovely and, and so kind, and like some people were just sharing their own stories with the game, obviously not spoiling things, which I really appreciate, uh, at least not, not story stuff, um, and the people were sharing little pieces of advice, so uh, turns out characters that you're not controlling in battle never jump, and do the uh, attacks in the air, so that's actually really something to. That, that's interesting. I can I can prove it by like going to anyone. So if I look at these, count zero. <laughs> uh, count zero. Okay, these ones have counts because I was playing as law for a bit. But you know, like so, it's just like, huh? That's really interesting. Why? <laughs> like, but, you know, I guess it's just a weird glitch or. Whatever, but no, I really appreciate it. So thank you both uh, both on Tails and Banjo. It's uh, people have been really kind um, But it's been a while. So let's see if I remember how to play. Oh, actually um, The dragon that came down from the heavens uh, the really powerful beast uh, That was not the same one that was in the demo um, In fact, I think the one in the demo was the mantis in the first area, but a weaker version It looked very similar if not the exact same. So uh, that's actually really interesting um but, uh, but yeah, no, so uh, let, let's move on. Um, I don't know what triggers the dragon, I guess it's just sometimes it shows up. But, uh, yeah, here we go, into the city. Very exciting, I'm genuinely, I'm buzzing, I'm really excited to play this again. Let's see if I remember how to play. Uh, yeah, we'll see. <laughs> oh, this place is pretty. I don't know what she was doing. She was, like, talking to no one and petting the air. I mean, petting the air is fine. You know, the air's been good. You know what I'm gonna do now? Thank you, air. You, you, you're keeping me alive. I appreciate you. No, 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 no. No, thank you. Thank you. That guy's just jerking off two people at once, you know? Vicent. Viscint? Viscint! Look, Renan soldiers. Do the Renans control this city? I've never seen so many of them in one place before. No. Look at the cores on them. These people are all Danans. They're slaves. If they are, they're awfully well dressed. And they're smiling too. Something weird's going on here. Forgive the intrusion, but if I'm not mistaken, you're newcomers to Elda Menencia, yes? Please, you have no reason to be alarmed. My name is Drashen. I work at the Department for Welfare. Department for Welfare? We work to support the day-to-day -day living of all citizens. Welcoming newcomers to the realm is a part of our job, albeit one we rarely have the pleasure to perform. Let me guess, we get a free pair of shackles as a welcome gift. Perish the thought. Your trepidation is perfectly understandable, but I assure you, our way is quite different. <sighs> In the past, this realm was no different from any other, and run by a rather merciless ruler. But all of that changed once His Excellency, Lord Dohalim, assumed power seven years ago. Dohalim. Under him, for the first time in our lives, we Danans were treated with the respect we deserve. Lord Dohalim is adored by Danans throughout the realm, and we serve him with gladness. Am I hearing you right? The Danans here willingly serve a Renan lord? Please, see for yourself. You're free to go anywhere you like. Just ask if you should need anything. What is it? Spit it out. It's just, we came here to free everyone. Uh-huh. But the Danans of this realm are all happy to serve Dohalim. Are there any walls that even need tearing down? Who cares? That just makes our path to Dohalim that much clearer. I guess, but... Still, Drashen said we should check things out for ourselves. Maybe we should look around a bit, see what we learn. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, so this Everyone place actually might wild. be... Like a, I've never a seen paradise this so lively before. Huh. Everyone walking the streets looks so calm and happy. 
I guess it really is true they don't treat Danans as slaves here. Did they actually somehow achieve equality here? And if they did, why? To what end? Something here doesn't feel right. Even though they sure want to act like it does. What is going through that Lord Dohalim's mind, I wonder? <sighs> Seems like Rimwell might know them. Interesting. Ah, I remember you. Do you need anything? This is Viscount. I really wish you would have said the name in a cutscene, for sure. The capital city of Elder Menacea. A beautiful, verdant, peaceful city full of life. The most beautiful landmark is Atelina Palace, the manor of Lord Dolin. His policies have ensured that we can live our lives free of oppression. Do you need anything else? Yeah, sure. Oh, it seems sure is. It's what sets this city apart. We're still technically slaves, but we get paid fairly for our work. So everybody's happy to work. The marketplace is booming, and worries about where food or lodgings come from are a thing of the past. It's all the result of Lord Dolim's reforms. And then, what else do you need? Is there anywhere we can rest? Ah, you must be tired after so long on the road. Uh, go up the stairs behind me, and you'll find an inn straight to your right. They've always got a barker girl out front, so you should be hard to, should be hard to miss. The beds there are great, so I highly recommend staying there at least once. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Well, I can't help but notice there's a side quest right here. Hello! Hmm. Excuse me, sir. You appear to be a stranger to these parts, right. yes? Uh, yeah, we came from out of town. Why? I apologize for the sudden proposition, but you wouldn't happen to have any granite fang on your person by any chance, would you? It's probably granite, isn't it? Uh, they come from the tusks of boar zugals that you can find outside the town. Mm -hmm. You're looking for zugal tusks? How come? To make weapons out of them? Can't be. Oh, no, nothing like that. Uh, you see those tusks change color when they detect poison. Eating utensils made from those tusks are quite popular at Artelina Palace, so I was hoping to stock up on some more of them. What? Is someone worried that they're being poisoned? Mm -hmm. Rena is a society that respects its hierarchy. It's hard for me to imagine anyone actually trying to poison a noble. Likewise, I've never heard of such a thing taking place. However, it's tradition at the palace to offer the tusks as something of a curio. <sighs> I tried to ask the guardsmen for their assistance, but they unfortunately appear to be occupied with more pressing matters. Hence, if you happen to have any granite fangs, I wish to ask that you hand me four of them. Do I have four? This? Sure, we can stand to give them away that many. Mm -hmm. Wonderful! Thank you so very much, kind sir. Now I have enough to make more utensils. Wow. Oh, you're the one who makes them then, huh? Mind if I watch you do that sometime? If you're okay with an audience, that is. <laughs> oh, of course! Please feel free to visit me whenever you have a moment to spare. I'd love it if you could also maybe turn some of those tusks into hey. a How often? Uh, uh, never mind. I think we're gonna head out now. <laughs> very well. Thank you again for your generosity. Sweet! Thank you for the geld! Is there gonna be another quest? No, you're just gone. Look at me. Great weapons. You need to stop this fixation with weapons. But you're the same way about food. Are you planning to stop that? <laughs> Alright, uh, how do I look at the map? Here we go. There is another cycle. Oh, there's a couple more side quests, actually. Okay, so I should probably go and do that, shouldn't I? Yeah, I'd say so. Um, sounds like our plan. Hello. Your armor rocks, big guy. Let me wear it. <laughs> our armor is certainly something even a denon like you could wear. You just need to grow into it first. I'll work hard to grow big and strong then. Promise. Huh. That's really interesting. This is so cool. I genuinely thought he was going to be having a pedicure. Hey, guardsman, shouldn't you be working? Uh, I don't know what it's like in the room you come from, but here in Menacina, everything's peaceful. There's zero chance of anything bad happening. Well, yeah, thanks to the Lord, life is nice for all of us. Yeah, see? Uh, it's more than just us, anyway. There's also the guardsmen. Nothing's gonna break if I slack off. Nonetheless, the reason the city's so peaceful is because you run and soldiers are around. 
All the younger kids idolize you, so don't shatter their illusions, please. Uh, you've got a silver tongue, mister. <laughs> Fine, I'll make this drink my last. Hmm. I guess we should stay at the inn. We've uh, been welcomed. Hello. What's this? Is that a tired looking customer I see? You'll find the perfect inn right beside me, or behind me. While you're out here waffling, you could be resting in one of the best, most soothing beds you'll find in town. Sounds cool. I'm up for that. I like soothing beds. Looks like we get to sleep with a roof over our heads. Hello, I would like to rest. Sure, why not? I will not cook because our stuff is still good. But... Nice. Lovely. I'm sure it was soothing. We didn't really get to appreciate it, but I'm sure it was. So yeah, there's still two more side quests here that I can check out. Do you oh. sense one of your friends? Hello. Where? Where? If I had to guess high up. Oh, I can hear you to the right. Where? Where? I can hear you, but where? No! <laughs> I take it you folks are all travellers? It's so wonderful to have you all here. Yes. You really don't bat an eye at us all being together, do you? Even though we have a run-in with us. Hmm? Are you surprised? I suppose it might not be a common sight elsewhere on Dana, but here in Vis Vicent, it's a part of everyday life. Hey, if we want to visit the palace, do we keep going sure. this way? Yes, that's exactly right. Although, if you ask me, the training grounds might be more up your alley, since you all appear to be of that persuasion. Training ground, you say? Is that code for some kind of arena where you make complete strangers fight and kill one another for sport? <laughs> no, absolutely not! It's nothing terrible like that. The training grounds are what they sound like. It's uh, true that years ago it used to be a really gruesome place where slaves had to fight each other as well as vicious yugles. But when our current Lord, Lo Lord Dohalim, came to power, one of the very first things he did was put a stop to such an awful spectacle. Mm. You're telling me a Renan Lord did that? The place was then refurnished and then it, and it reopened as a proper place to train like it's known for these days. <laughs> it's mainly designed to be used by the Elder Menacean Guard, but it's also open to anyone who wishes to use its facilities. Mm. Anyone? Even Dernan? Sure. Of course. The arena is far too punishing for me, but if you're looking to hone your skills, I recommend you pay it a visit. Oh, that sounds cool. Oh, hype! We're gonna spend the time... Uh, yeah, we'll get our priority. We're gonna spend time doing, like, actual arena side quests. That sounds amazing. Where is the owl? I can hear you. I just can't see you. Actually, that might be my owl making that noise, to be fair. So you're around somewhere. Okay, not here. Here is too far away. You pop up around here. I've probably looked at you like four, four times. I think you're in here somewhere, but I don't know where. Oh, there! Look at you! Hoot hoot! I got a halo, baby! I think uh, we've got half of the owls now, so that's pretty cool. Maybe something's going on in the forest. Oh, I guess something triggered. So, about the owl. So, I'm, I'm intrigued. I, I'm wondering if this game is going to pull a Dragon Quest Eleven on us, where you get to the Fifth Lord, and then something drastic happens that changes the entire voice. game. Somebody's asking. I could help. be wrong. But I do wonder Hopefully if that's going to be a thing. That'll be too hard to deal with. Okay. I gather you guys came here along the highway, yeah? You didn't happen to run into that thing along the way, did Ah. If it's the dragon, yes. <laughs> what thing? I'm talking about the huge Zugle that flies around the skies, occasionally dropping down to attack both people and Zugles alike. Mm -hmm. Attacks even Zugles? That's something you don't see meet every day. Mm. Yeah, this guy's really something. Even the uniforms have a hard time dealing with it. I even tried putting a bounty on it to sweeten the pot. You could say, you, you could say but everybody's just about giving up on it. Got it. 
In that case, we'll handle it. I'm sure we'll find a way to get rid of it. Hmm? You really think you have what it takes? I mean, you all look capable, don't get me wrong, but uh... We got this, don't worry. As a matter of fact, we've got someone here who can practically shoot down flying zoogles with her eyes closed. Just great. You mean Xion? I don't think she's going to appreciate you volunteering here for this. Well, if you think you can handle it, that'd be great! You'll find it flying around Tr Trasilda Highway. Normally, I'll leave you alone, but if it's... Uh, it'll leave you alone, but if it sees a fight break out, that's when it swoops in to cause trouble. Oh. Meaning that the only way to attract this attention is if we fight other zoogles first? You got it! It's a pain in the ass to be sure, but a clever pain in the ass at that. Well, we're off to go hunt it. You better have that bounty ready by the time we get All back. Right. Of course, I'm a man of my word. Happy hunting! Right, I think that's something I should probably not do just yet. Because... That thing what kicked my ass last for? time. What else? Eating until my stomach bursts. That sounds really oh, actually. Alley. Uh... Yeah, there's a gold thing down here. So it looks like this is where the arena is. Um, oh, there's actually another quest down here. Oh! I thought the quest for the arena was was that was that one I saw there, but no, 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 there's another one down here. Okay, cool, cool. I'm fine with that. I I love doing side quests in this game. I I can't tell you how happy I am to be playing this again. I love this game so much. Around here who could use our help? We can't chase after. E Did all those people move here? Dad says that people used to ca have to carry lots of heavy and dangerous stuff. I don't know if I believe that. I can't imagine that kind of stuff ever happening here. Hmm. Oh, hello. Are you okay? Huh. Uh, hey, you okay? Wait, you're that foodie we ran into before, aren't you? Yes. Oh, why, hello there, Blazing Sword. I haven't seen you since we were in Cislodia. Needless to say, I'm hungry. Again? Well, give the man some of those mushrooms you just picked. Ah, God, you never learn anything, do you? Just what sort of wretched fungus are you trying to stuff down my throat? I don't know. I think they're pretty good. Wow. I wish I shared your unfounded courage, my boy. Anyway, that's beside the point. I'm here in Vincent on important business. <laughs> Though carefully invest a careful investigation and some sneaky round, I have acquired a top secret recipe for none other than the palace itself. However, I'm short on ingredients. Can I ask you all to procure what I need once more? Huh? Back up a little. What was all that you said about sneaking around? Oh, before I answer that, tell me, do you enjoy meat? Hell yeah, I do. Who doesn't? <laughs> well, the recipe I pilfered is none other than beef for, for beef stew. A first-rate dish that's all about its meat. Hey. So did you steal the recipe is what you're saying? So what if I did? Who cares? Now, what do you say? Will you gather what I need or not? And I'm pretty sure this guy's breaking the law. Hmm? Eh, he only uncovered a recipe from the palace. I don't think that quite makes him a criminal. <laughs> Precisely! I simply took what I learned from those snake eyes I saw in Cislodia and put it to use in the name of fine cuisine. Am I really hearing this? What I need is meat and potatoes, as well as mushrooms and tomatoes. You'll get those for me, won't you? Right. Now we've already got what you're looking nice for. Work. In that case, I need you to follow this recipe here and cook me a beef stew right away. Why are you making me cook again? <laughs> Can't wait to see how this turns out, Alfin. <sighs> Come on, isn't the stew ready yet? Uh, Sorry, Law. Says here I have to let it simmer for five hours. No way. Five hours?! That beef would have tasted perfectly fine if we just grilled it up real quick. I don't believe if that's it. how you're going to act, boy, then you can forget about having any. <laughs> All right, looks like it's done now. Oh, ho, look at that beautiful dish! It smells just as divine too. Now to see how it tastes. What? Oh, this, this is absolutely exquisite! I'm in heaven. Truly, this is the golden age of cooking we live in. I guess. It doesn't really tell us anything about how it actually tastes. I'd say I feel like its reaction is even more dramatic than last time. Oh well. Why don't you try some next, Law? Yeah. Sure, I'll have some. Whoa. Holy crap! This meat is so tender, I feel like it's gonna melt right in my mouth! The sauce is so rich and packed with the taste of the meat and veggies. It gives the whole uh, an un unbelievably deep is flavor. 
These veggies too, they're so meaty and tasty, just the way they are. They make for a really nice complimentary side dish. Whoever came up with this meal really thought every dish through. I can see why the palace would serve it. You know, Cordino, you could take a page out of Lost Book when it comes to actually explaining how things taste. God, you people don't understand anything. All that boy does is slap his jaws. Listen, you uncultured oaf. Flavor is something you express with your whole body. No, your very soul. Were you watching that? Did you see how I moved with every fiber of my being? Open your eyes wide and burn this next sight into your brain. Ready? Absolutely. I get it, I get it. I was wrong. I need to get all worked up about it. Yes. Putting that aside, my palate and stomach are completely and utterly satisfied. I can now leave this realm with no regrets. <laughs> in, it's time I leave in search of even greater cuisines. Oh well! Sweet. Thanks. I wonder what that does. Man, that was amazing! No wonder the old man was so gung-ho about it. <laughs> See? What did I tell you? Shion? You've got sauce on your face. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's go to the arena, shall we? Quite excited to see what this is like. Oh, hello. Curious about what I'm wearing? I bought this myself, if you'll believe it. Nowadays, we Danans get paid a fair wage for the work we do. It's all thanks to Lord Darlin. I still can't believe I'm seeing Danans and Renans getting along. You never know. It could all be an act on orders from the Renans. To what end? It would be an incredible amount of effort just to fool us. Let's check out more of the city. There's probably places we haven't seen yet. Sure is. Like this place. I am excited for this arena. If this is a minigame of sorts, hell yeah. Wow, I got some experience for doing basically nothing. <laughs> Sweet. So these are the training grounds. The atmosphere here feels different compared to the rest of Vicent. It's just a nicer name for a place where people go to fight. So? It's still a good way for us to test our strength. Stop sweating the small stuff. Welcome to the training grounds, the pride of Vicent. If you're looking for a place to take your training to the next level, you've come to the right place. We embrace anybody who walks through our doors as long as you want to improve yourself. You'll always have a place to train here. I can already tell from looking at you all that you don't want to simply improve either. You want to be the best at what you do, am I right? Then step right up and throw down the gauntlet. We'll be more than happy to put you through your paces. Okay, let's do a solo battle. Oh, with each person or group battle. Okay, so novice, target time is three minutes, I think. Um, and... Oh no, that's the target clear time, okay. Oh, it's recommended level 30. Oh, jeez. Oh, that's not, that's not okay then. We don't really want to do that, but I do want to do this. No rematches for 60 minutes, so I get one shot of this. Alright, well, we'll do this one. Your training has only just begun. you got a long, harsh road ahead, but trust me, all that experience will inevitably pay off in the end. Take everything you see and, le and learn and, and use it to better yourself. Okay, let's go. I am ready. Oh, nice. Ooh. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go, ready to annihilate you all. Oh, love that. Kill all. I have missed battling in this game. It's so good. Ah, oh, that was unfortunate. <laughs> I was gonna say, am I gonna miss you every time? There wasn't a time limit on this one, was there? I don't think there was. Oh, love it. So good. Yes, goodbye. Big, tremendous rip for you. Oh, hello, there's a lot more. I wasn't expecting so many, but I want to leave. <laughs> and take them all down. Here we go. Whoop. Oh, love that. That's what I like to see. Oh, oh, that was unfortunate. I got blocked. Oh, no. That's bad. Shion in your own time. Thank you. 
I knew you'd come through. I always believed in you. Nice. Oh, such a good move. I have... Oh God, I've missed playing this game so much. Are you the final one? And if so, I am going to annihilate you. Just, just bear with as I destroy everything you hold dear. Oh, we're not done. I'm sorry, did you think it was going to be that easy? No, no. Of course it's not. Whoa. You did a lot of damage. Oh, man. Yeah, these are not easy enemies for sure. I want to get out of here. There we go. Oh, boy. Hello. I just realised I'm not using these. I should probably use them. <laughs> it would not be a bad idea. On the basis that, you know, they're, they're only kind of powerful. Oh, that was unfortunate. Oh, nice. Something you want to say? Not so long as you keep them pointed toward the enemy. Oh no! Here we go. I'm so ready to annihilate you. Come on. Love it. Come on. So I'm guessing this is the final round. I don't think I'm going to do the novice round yet, on the basis that it said I should probably be level 30. That that seems like it would, uh, I say flattened my chair. Um, I, I lifted the chair up with the clap of my ass cheeks because I was so excited, and then I flattened it from being too excited that I sat down again. It's not every day I see such immense refined talent on display. Um, that's my first victory. To celebrate the immense strength, I offer you this special prize. Sweet, silver dog tag. Good, good. Okay, so. And I can't do it again for another uh, 60 minutes. Makes sense. So you can only do this every every so often. Is that. So how does that. Is that 60 minutes in game or 60 minutes? So if I was to turn the game off and come back an hour later, would it be unlocked? I guess we'll find out eventually. But uh, yeah, that's. I would love to do that, but it does say recommend a level 30. I'm sure I'm going to get annihilated. I will try a solo battle. So Alpha and Training. And then, that is some rare stuff. I'm level 21, I don't think I'm going to be too good on that. So I'm not going to do that, I think. Um, but let's uh, certainly try... Oh, hello. I believe in my own power, it's going to be good. Yes, that's what I like to see. You're not really dying, are you? Yeah, you're not really taking damage right now. Oh, gee, there we go. Boost breaks the way. Yeah, I figured that was the, the key. But damn. Like, you're not making it easy. Oh, man, I need a lot more of that. Is it that? Yeah, that, that is good. Ooh, yes. Oh, love it. Bye. Ah, oh, it's your first hit on me as well. Good game. Oh, not a good game. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I was going to say, you're not broken. So this is kind of rough, actually. Did I get you both? No, I just got one of you. Okay, noted. Nice. Okay, that's good. I need to stop you! Okay, that's gonna be bad. It's gonna be rough. Come on! Oh no! Nah, it's fine. I'm not worried. Not that worried, at least. So yeah, you're, I was gonna say, you're still untouchable right now. I will get to you in a sec, I just need my uh, stuff to return, and then you will be annihilated, just bear with. 
Oh, I just realized how low my health is. Yeah, I can't really do another one of, uh, another one of those. Yeah, I think I'm just going to stick with this attack. Because it is very good, and I don't lose health or that I do it. Oh, I did two in a row. I mean, it was helpful, but it didn't. It, the second one missed. Oh, nice, good game. That was fun. All right, so I got some items for that. I got some sage. Uh, oh, I didn't do it in the target time. Interesting. So if I did it in the target time, I'd get some lemon gel. Okay, so that's a good way to grind some lemon gel, and also like it's a good way to just get better at fighting. Um, I think it'll be one of those easier things when I'm more powerful. <whistles> yeah. Rending Titan Fang sounds good. There's two of them as well. It's level five. Uh, but that's... Oh, that's actually a first clear bonus. You get that just for beating it. Um... Yeah, so damage inflicted only after downing an enemy. Yeah, that's what I thought. I am going to try this once, knowing full well I'm going to immediately get annihilated. So, let's uh, let's see what happens. I'm fully aware that I'm going to die. Like, 100%. Like, I've barely touched you. Like, I've barely dented you. And obviously, you're not going to be the only one. There's no way you're going to be the only enemy. If you are, I will eat a hat. Like, an actual hat. Well, that was nice. I'm quite enjoying these attacks. Oh, nice. Like, the fact that I'm actually beating this enemy, slowly, admittedly, but I'm actually winning, is it feels good. <laughs> Can't deny. Oh, the poison is not great, though. Yeah, that's what I thought. You can't use items. Yeah, I thought that was going to be the case. Yeah, that poison is rough, man. There's nothing I can do. I'm dead. Oh, no, that's not true. I've got one HP, baby. Oh, okay, so you never... Okay, so you can never actually die doing this. I did not know that. That's good to know. Now I'm dead. <laughs> of course I am! <laughs> the fact that I did half your health is a miracle. Uh, so, if I was to go and check out other people... So, you get Pineapple Jail for the target clear. Uh, Camille. And well, we're all training. Rosemary. Again, you get some good stuff. Um, yeah, okay. Well, I think, like, the, uh... Man, Majestic Fairy. Yeah, these are good stuff. Diamond Fest. These are clearly really powerful items. Uh, yeah, the... This is something I'm going to do in my own time, I think. I'm going to practice how to play with all the characters, because I think it's going to be one of those things where... Oh... Did I get that for beating the skill? Oh, actually, maybe I do want to do them all now. Hmm... That alone cements that it would be worthwhile. Um, okay, so let's see what we get. No need to be charged in exchange for greater damage dealt. Also, the cost of more HP consumed. Um, that's a doubt. Increase defense and elemental defense when the death. Oh, that's good. Hmm, I'm gonna go with that. That seems good as well. Um,. Can't do that. Sure, let's see what it's like. Um, that's an that's an art, right? So I what do I want to get rid of? I'm gonna get rid of. Uh, wait, back it up. Where, wait, 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 back it up. What was it again? Rending Flash. Crap. 
Spending flash. Is it not here? Oh. Oh, wait, it's in it's in this. It's a flaming edge move. I see. My bad. I misinterpreted. I see, I see. Well that's good to know, I suppose. Um So these flaming edge moves, is it because I've not bought them in the skill panel? It actually might be. Maybe not. I don't know. Um, I am unsure. There are so many more skill trees that are going to be unlocked over time. So, if I was to play as, say, Law, would Law unlock another thing? Let me take a look, shall we? Oh, nice. Oh, that's good. Oh, no. Oh, no, I think I dodged it. Nice. That was awesome. Oh, that's good. More of that. More. Kill everything. Love it. Oh, oh that's unfortunate. The, 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 the power was... Oh, hello. More of you. I was say, like, it would have been powerful had I actually nailed it. Love it. Oh, love that. Yeah, you are not weak. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Loving that. God, I just, I love how Law fights, it's so cool. Whoops. Less good for me, but that's fine. Move. I really don't want to die. Ugh. Oh, that was lucky. Nice. Oh god, I've got to be very careful not to accidentally hit you. Yes. Ugh. I've got to be so careful. Are you dead? Oh, you're dead. Okay, great. Move, move! Okay. Oh, it's genuine fear. Oh, that was good. Look at that. Okay, so there. This definitely wasn't fast enough, I'm pretty sure. But it was fun. I got some lavender. Oh, it was close, though. So did Lord get a bonus? No. Okay, good to know. So it was just because we engaged in battle here. Well, now seems like a good time to end. We uh, we did a lot this time. Um, next time, we're going to explore more of the city and maybe go to the palace. And yeah, I'll see you then.